Festivities are wrapping up. This place is rocking. The home opener is coming up next. And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. The show brings you game one of a big four-game set. It's the Los Angeles Angels and the Detroit Tigers. John Shabby and Chris Singleton with you. We're going to have a special atmosphere for this one, Singy. These fans have been waiting a long time to get back inside the ballpark and support their favorite team. Yeah, we knew today would be electric, but after their team picked up a few road wins to kick off the year, I think the energy inside this stadium is going to be turned up an extra yeah. notch. So let's Yo, see if they can keep this Detroit. good start going here at home. Tiger. Next to the plate is the Tigers DH. Jay Matt, a guy who makes an impact not just at the plate, but also in the field. On the ground. He's in there. Did a nice job getting there. Good throw, but very difficult to get anybody on that one as far as you had to go and throw. You know? Yeah, no question. And now the first baseman, Glenn Stevenson. Righty delivers. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. One left for Detroit. We played an inning. No score. One out, base is empty. Jay Mack hey, up now for the Tigers. Now All around, I think if you hitter. asked anyone in this organization, who's the best Matt. hitter hey, in the lineup, they would say him. Swing and a ball yeah, lifted ball. in the yeah. air, left field, pretty well struck. Automatic double now as it hops the wall in foul ground. He put a drive into that ball, and he was rewarded for it for sure. He probably wondered a little bit if he got enough of it to clear the fence in the air, but I'm sure he's plenty happy jogging into second with the automatic double. And up next for Detroit, Glenn Stevenson. Now back. Right-hander kicks baseman. deals. Glenn. In the dirt. Stevenson. Well done behind the dish. Hitter's got some good opposite field power. What I like about something being hit to the right side into the outfield is that the base runner at second has a very good read and can determine whether or not he can score on that base hit. Mack leads off second with one let gone in the inning. Next offering way off the plate. Hey, get your pitch, stay through it. Let's go, drive it. Move to second, Matt, back in on a dive. So right now here. three and two, and that's ball four. Man, that's a tough one to take on the full count, but I guess he saw it really well. It's a really nice play up here. So one out with two aboard. Now the left fielder, Roberto Campos. And a 3-1 on the way. And a big swing and a miss. Well, he looks fresh out there, just... Needs to get a little more confidence and remember how good he's been in the past. Hey, see so you didn't drive in here. Righty to the plate. Popped up. We got an infield play, if fair. Now batting, catcher. From now here's the Detroit catcher, Francisco Alvarez. Alvarez. Hey, see it and rip it up there, kids. See it and rip it. 
The next nope. pitch misses two and one. Good spot for the hitter. Definitely has the advantage in this count with runners on. Look for him to be aggressive on this next pitch. Yes, next three. one misses, Attaboy. and that's ball three. Looks like the weather could actually play a factor in this one. It's coming down pretty good. Yeah, it is, and it's not too bad yet, but the field's not going to be able to hold up if the rain gets any worse than this. So keep an eye on the pitcher's mound as well, and the rest of the infield start to puddle up a little bit. On a line out towards center. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out, and that'll do it. Tigers strand a pair, but they're on top by a count of three to nothing. So two down. Next is the Tigers DH. Jay Mack. He's now a catcher back. by the trade, but the hitter. DH here yeah. in this one. Mack. Come on now, get your pitch up there. Ripped on the ground a second. Sends it to first. That is the inning. Jay Mack up now right, for the right Tigers. Here. Good contact guy, now, good defender. Pretty amazing yeah. athlete this guy is. Power and speed, quite a threat. I mean, you're talking about someone that could steal your bag and go deep. Bo Jackson, anyone? Oh, that Small guy belted. Go. That one carrying. Get Can't get their base hit. Now around second, going for third. Safe at third with a triple, his third hit of the day. Putting some good swings on the ball. That's his second extra base hit in this one. Man, I love the hustle out of the box right there to make that triple happen. And just an absolute laser into the opposite field gap. He was digging hard the entire way. Runner at third, two gone. And now it's going to be Glenn now Stevenson. Back. The first baseman. Glenn. And a 1-1. One -one. When you have a real athletic player and who's able to do the baseball mechanical things really well, look out because the sky's the limit on that potential. Swing and a miss, and that is that. Tigers leave one, and it remains 5-2. in a row you start to think a little bit that you're on a roll and that's the momentum that just takes on a life of its own guys start hitting up and down the lineup you never know who's going to come up with the big hit who's going to come out of the bullpen and get the big outs but it's a good feeling and you want to extend it a 5-3 final score in this one for Chris Singleton and our entire crew I'm John Chomby saying